I think the most important thing for anyone taking the flights is to understand their purpose of travel. So tourism definitely works closely with the aviation side, whether it's business travel or leisure travel. But I think the important thing is that we have to realize that post-COVID, a lot of things have changed. Uh, the travelers' uh, um, pattern, behavior, and what they want to do, and why they travel, it's actually changed a bit. So we've got to understand that. The good thing about, I think, aviation is that we have seen uh, post-COVID, all these uh, digitalization and technology actually can help, has helped the whole journey becoming much, much more painless. And, and in fact, it's a fantastic thing now people can do, you know, online applying for visa, going to the airport, you don't even have to show your passport and everything is facial recognition, you just walk past those channels and everything. So I think it's fantastic. It's actually help not only development of aviation but also tourism so the whole thing get together very well i found that it seems like it's uh, um, europe it's having this problem more se severe than uh, other parts of the world now maybe in in asia where we are from uh, no, we haven't actually seen that yet and i remember having a chat with a professor from uh, Europe last week actually we're talking about they said the tourism authorities in Europe are actually looking more about planning or city planning and how to um, divert uh, tourists to other places uh, uh, rather than just focusing on the city or the main attractions which is quite different from Asia we're still kind of at a stage where we're promoting or marketing about it and I think it will be fantastic for us to start thinking about these things. I think the interesting thing is that we might actually occur to me that we are going back to, uh, you know, the, the whole tourism aviation 30, 40 years ago when the airlines and the tourism authorities worked together to promote certain destination, but beyond just destination, but certain experiences, events, good stories, so that you, know, you, you actually give a reason for the travelers to travel, to see the place, to experience, but in a more sustainable way.